Right, hello everybody, welcome to game number 10 against Bloody Lizard Men. This could go poorly if he's competent. Let's hope he isn't. Um, 5 4 1. So, maybe, you know, 5 4 1 with any other race, you're thinking pretty decent. When it's Lizard Men, well, I think you could blindfold somebody, unplug their mouse, <laughs> cut off their toes. <laughs> and their hands and, <laughs> and if they just <laughs> mouthed the, the keyboard <laughs> they would eventually uh, win half their games with lizards <laughs> but <laughs> um, also he could have just he could have known what he's doing and uh, he, they could know what he's doing and being unlucky but he's got a lot of skills on his so skinks um, you know, <laughs> um, yeah, got a bit of guard. That's why I, I get disgusted every time I don't win every single game. Like if I if I go ten and zero with lizard men, then that's acceptable. Anything less than ten and zero is is bad. Sorry, Webley. You can get diced. I mean, the bad thing about lizards is you can get diced. You know, and you can if you don't give up, you can get diced a few, a few times. <laughs> Dive and tackle, going for the sage strats. Yeah, <laughs> it's quite good against me, though, isn't it? The horrible bastard. Fuck you, ten or oh. it's not. It's, it, yeah, it's it's not impossible, KLZD, but. You, you do get diced, obviously. But, you know, with lizards, you get diced. So I end up not enjoying lizards because I used to enjoy lizards. I used to enjoy playing lizards. But then with streaming, like, I find that I put myself under more pressure, which obviously I shouldn't. I should put myself under less pressure because you can't play as well when you're streaming if, you, if you're talking and chatting and everything and just not really concentrating on it. But I put myself under more pressure to get a better record, which is I know is stupid. Fair enough. And then, so then, you know, lizards still get dice, don't they? They get dice quite easily as well, because, you know, if I, if you're if your strength four armor nine guys get removed, or if like every time you hit a skink, like you know, you don't expect them, you don't expect to cast a skink every time you hit them, right? You're knocking them over at best seventy five percent of the time, not breaking armor that much, and then not casting them that much. So like, you should really probably expect what one in, if you're lucky. If you're lucky and hitting with mighty blow, you should be thinking about what one in five hits make a cars or something, or one in six hits make a cars. And then, uh, but but so if if you take four hits and you take four cars skinks, you, you're getting dice pretty hard, aren't you? Does he have any tackle? No. So there is there's got something going for us. Dibby! Dibby! I guess Dimmy just gets to be a reserve. No, no, Dimmy gets to play instead of this, uh... This 5SPP one. He'll get to come on and make his completion. While Dimmy can just get smashed to fuck. That seems a good... Good idea. Yeah, I'm not saying it's easy to go ten and all, but um, I w I wouldn't webble No, I'd always go block. <laughs> Hello, Rusey Who? Thanks. Yeah, Patrick, but I'm talking about a rookie one, right? So. If you've got block and tackle and they're defenceless, at best it's seventy-five percent knockover, isn't it? Hitting them with two dice, so at best you're looking at four knockdowns from six blocks, three knockdowns from four blocks. <laughs> yeah, six knockdowns from eight blocks, right? Six knockdowns from eight blocks, and then you break armor about half the time, and then out of those you don't even cast a third of the time, so. 
eight blocks for one Kaz is like totally reasonable. Which is crazy, isn't it? And then people just expect to Kaz, and that's hitting with block tackle mighty blow. Hitting a defenseless skink with block tackle mighty blow expects one Kaz every eight blocks. Yeah, people just literally expect to Kaz them every time they hit them. And, and you can get Kaz every time you hit, can't you? That's the thing. And then you're in then you're in a lot of trouble. And like Saurus can just get cast out by a random block easily. Well not easily, but happens, doesn't it? What's this team got? It's easy to go ten and all, but um, I will, it's easy to go 10 and all. <laughs> yes, I was saying it's not easy to go 10 and all, and you just did that. Very good, very good hand back. <laughs> not saying it's easy. <laughs> you just got the not saying. People do that as well, don't they? People do that on the news and stuff. Pretty disgusting. This was a nice LOS block, wasn't it? And <laughs> a skull! Oh, you lucky bastard! I mean, obviously not lucky to double skull. Oh, no, he didn't. I thought I thought it was the Crocs. I literally thought it was the Crocs, and I thought he'd made the loner. Okay, that's not... Obviously, it wasn't lucky to re-roll it then. Duh. <laughs> All right, well, that wasn't anywhere near as unlucky as I thought. I thought he'd double skulled with the uh, Crocs. And then he would got really lucky to loner re-roll it, but... He was just unlucky to dub skull. Woo! Stand firm diving tackle. Crikey. Don't know why he's not hitting with the crocs there, because he's got mighty blow, hasn't he? He's, he hasn't got any rerolls left, so he might as well just. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's a dice game, isn't it? Even, Mully, even Big Mully D only won 80% of the time. <laughs> it's because I didn't say it, L. It's just hard for me to do it. Complete dickhead. <laughs> Maybe a bit harsh, but there you go. <laughs> oh, God. This is quite nice, this actually, isn't it? Because this could be a bit of a team split here. He gets the power with Mighty Blow. Everyone else fails. And the Mighty Blow gets the power. But I mean, it was good taking the ball with their actions, obviously. Right, let's go. All in. All in, you only live twice. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Oh, thank you very much, whoever that is. Sorry, I've got a play Blood Bowl, so uh, can't see. Got to re-roll this, this dodge. It's a screen the tackle. Oh, it's diving. I'll dodge through diving tackle. I, I specifically went through the skink on the other dodges, obviously, because I'm not an idiot. And then I thought, oh, well, I can go there, and then he can come around here, and then screen off completely. But obviously, 
Diving tackle, absolute dickhead. So he had to tag the diving tackle as well, so he couldn't go anywhere. And then he was going to come around, and yeah, I guess I had to JFI as well. Oh, well, never mind. Absolutely fuck that. I didn't mock him. <laughs> I didn't mock him. Wow. Wow, that was super bad. Uh, this is exactly what my problem with Diamond Tackle. It's only good if people are absolutely terrible. And uh, there you go. I was absolutely terrible. So it was effective. <laughs> it was very effective because I played terribly. Absolutely. Exactly. Exactly what I said. Feels good to be right. <laughs> Feels good to be right. Fuck off, Ardvac. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> oh, it's so annoying, isn't it? It's so annoying. Like, I'm, I went through there on purpose because I thought fucking... I thought fucking... Auto path will probably take me through the diamond tackle. Like I was literally thinking about him moving the other two. And then didn't there. But I mean I did one in there. If he'd been there and then the other catcher had been here. Things would have been quite nice. So I guess this turn has got to be a rescue. Rescue the team somehow. I don't really know how. I guess he's, he's got two Saurus over here. That's good. <laughs> Pals me, Blodger. Stunned. Fucking stunned. That's a one in nine for this one. Makes it pair, doesn't it? Fails. Cosmic. It's gone great, this. Really fun game thus far. Woo! Hollow unconcerned elf. Fuck me, KL said he. What do you want me to do? What, like, literally, what do you want me to do with this guy? Instead, he's right there. Obviously, you punch him. You can do not punch him. <laughs> Just not fucking punch him. That'd be smart, wouldn't it? There was, there was nowhere I could have gone with him. The good thing is the diamond tackle doesn't actually have tackle, does he? So he's and he's splitting his splitting his uh Saurus off a bit here, isn't he? He's got four Saurus here. And while Saurus are fast Um they're not as mobile as elves, are they? So maybe something could happen to uh 
stick them. Okay, how's the day? I'm not going to dodge away when I can punch with my E-Blow. <laughs> this guy was going to blitz, but I failed before it. He was going to dodge, blitz, and then if he diamond tackled, of course, there's a 50-50 chance that I'm away anyway, and he's a diamond tackle is on the floor, which is very nice. And if he did do that, I could have hit the ball, which would have been good. But unfortunately, of course, I failed the one in nine first. Oh, this guy's taken max time every turn. There you go, just kill the skinks, easy. <laughs> Classic easy. <laughs> Get football. off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> So 50-50 it works first time, and then even when he diamond tackles, 50-50 he's on the floor and I'm away, so I quite like this stuff. Wonderful cars though, and they're very lucky. Powered his blodger and Kazdin. Oh god, he's taking so long. It is a Kaz and a skink, yeah. yeah I blocked what blocked a skink once and Kazd him instantly. <laughs> classic classic Reddit strats. Yeah, this guard wasn't uh, in a bad spot, but I liked that it was a ju he was a juicy target, and I didn't mind him blitzing him rather than breaking through. Right, he could have broken through this time. So he was a bit of a bit of a tempter there. Let's the tackle. That's nice. Ces joueurs sont tout proches. Le combat paraît inévitable. Of course, there's not anything stopping him going forward, is there? And now his crocs is on millions of people. Interesting, isn't it? Le ballon est 
en sécurité. À l'autre équipe de prouver le contraire. Non, il se fucking stand for. Can I get? He can get to there. Well, that's pretty tempting. Ça sent la bonne grosse empoignade. I could blitz him, but he's not—he's not doing anything. That's the problem. So blitz here and then move back, I can free up something. Lack of sidestep is very disappointing. He could go here, I guess, and try and punch him. That's probably the best thing to do. As you can see, he would have not have killed a skink there. So, a good portion of the time, you don't even knock people over, do you? So. Yes, hello, Joseph. Yeah, the uh, <laughs> the DT did wreck me because I was I was a fool. Hey, one in eighty one wrecked him though, because he was a fool by not going block first. Woohoo! I don't want to stick myself in down and tackle, it's fucking annoying isn't it? But I don't really want to try and free everything up before then. Hey. I'm not going to dodge away so I just have to fall. Okay, okay, that's pretty good. That's pretty good.
Well, fish, fish for the pow. I thought it was worth it. He can try to dodge away at the end, I guess. That's okay, putting him on this ass is pretty great. <laughs> if he wants to diamond tackle, he can. Woo! Knock down a Saurus! Great skill. <laughs> if only I hadn't fucked it earlier. If only I hadn't fucked it earlier, break tackle, uh, diamond tackle would have only been bad for him. He's still in the wrong square, wasn't he? That was very unlucky of him, obviously, the one in 81. But he could have taken block first on his Saurus. And at the end of the day, you've got to take block first on your Saurus. You've just got to. For what? Oh, you bastard. For what tiny bit of utility you get from... Uh, well, not utility. From what tiny bit of acceleration you get from Mighty Blow is just not worth the utility you get from block, is it? like he's not doing any freeing up to hit the ball with a Saurus, so he's just going for the 3 plus dodge against tackle. I guess he can just push the tackle away. <laughs> but it's against tackle if he doesn't push him away first. And right now it's a one because he hasn't got any guard or any assists. Like he hasn't cancelled this assist because he diving tackles. <laughs> this is a one -er. So it's a 3 plus anyway, so he should probably just do the dodge from tackle. Woo! No, no kills it. That's nonsense spouted by idiots. <laughs> hey, so yeah, he had to make the Crux block first. It's just entirely situational, web web. Just entirely situational. Hello, Sparky. Sparky, Sparky, Sparky. The legend of the cup. <laughs> um, yeah, just, it would, entirely, entirely situational. If you, if you ask me, Weblin, because, you know... Oh, fuck you. Because... <laughs> because, uh... You know, sidesteps on them really good. Sprinting sure your feet is fine. So it would just depend on, like, how much money you had and, uh... And, you know, where the TV was and all that. There's so many things that would go into making the decision. I kind of hate... Not that I hate the people that do it, but I kind of hate this idea of sack him after X amount of skills or whatever. I just think that's that's stupid. You've got to uh, you've got to just you know do it on a decide on a on a individual basis depending on what happens. Well, he made two dodges off away from tackle, so that's disappointing. Hey. He makes a rando. Oh no, it's not a rando GFI. He's got to get in scoring range, hasn't he? Well, he's not in scoring range. But I would really, I would really like his ball. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's hard to hit the ball, isn't it? Well, I'm not going this way. No, he's there. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, GFI. Oh, I sense that it's going to be a suicide. I could power him, but it's not really worth it, is it? Oh, you motherfucker! 
Double one. <laughs> oh well, can't even get a scoring threat. Woo! Of course, if I had punched him, then there was no dodge there, and then I would have had the scoring threat. But then, on the other hand, I wanted to maybe get two scoring threats through. Also, this guy could have gone one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now he couldn't have got the assist. In. So it was just scoring threat. And then he would have come round. But at least he couldn't have sidestepped forward when I punched him. That was the idea of that guy there. That was a disappointing double one. Oh, he's got this guy. Oh, shit, he, he can score. Ah, oh, well, maybe. <laughs> maybe I should have blocked him and then punched him. Yeah, I don't know. I think it's okay. I think you can forget a source and try and get your own catcher. Can everyone who says Sorai fuck off, please? It's Saurus. Alright. It's Saurus. It's a word made by Games Workshop. They say the plural is Saurus, so the plural is Saurus. That's it. No discussion, you can all take your fucking Latin or whatever and fuck off. <laughs> Alright. Good. <laughs> they invented the fantasy race of creature called Saurus. Yes, Odon, they sure did. <laughs> Much like Adeptus R um what is it? Adeptus uh whatever the fuck they're called now. <laughs> Black girl. Whatever they, whatever they renamed them. Adeptus. Oh, there's the the militarum, isn't there? There's all that was some bullshit. Astards. Yeah, oh, yeah, Astartes. Yeah, exactly. They did make that, so that's why they've called everything out. Fuck off with your powers. Really, Necrimpins? That's uh, that's wild. <laughs> Sorry, the chat. <laughs> Alright, he went for the dodge. Cazzed himself. <laughs> Sometimes lucky. Sometimes lucky. Woo! Flip me, guys. Right, he's gonna punch him. Oh, there's a guy there. Alright, he's gonna punch him. Kaz him, because he's got a tackle. No, oh, never lucky. Come on. Good lad. Let's fucking go. Get him. Fucking don't get him then, you absolute tool bag. <sighs> so annoying. Oh yeah, yeah, you can get three powers, can't you, you dickhead? <laughs> oh god. God damn it. Instant removal. <laughs> Got a completion at least this far. That was disappointing. That was very close to a turnover, wasn't it? 
very close to a turnover. And offense is going to be tricky with this stand firm diamond tackle going, you know, going places. Very lucky to have him down the source. The DAC is less, less appealing for winning the game. The HA tactic, yeah, that's the one. Ha! I'll make the hat emote soon. I mean, when they can when they can get a tail and DT somewhere, that uh, that's that's problematic, isn't it? That's true, Ducky. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Three guard is nice, isn't it? There's no tackle. Can just punch things. Punch, 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 punch. Pass, pass, pass. <laughs> right, where's Dimmy? Dimmy! I'll claw the guards. Right, so you can block him on two. And then he can block him on two somehow. And then he can maybe go in and block him on two as well. We'll see what happens. Like it's really tempting to move there for the quick snap, isn't it? But I guess it's a bit fucking greedy. Right. I don't, I don't remember Ducky, I don't. As you found out, I just, uh, I just, fuck off, and you'll be fucking perfect. Like, another great thing about the, the Dakar is perfect defence doesn't bother you at all, does it? I fucking knew it'd be a perfect defence. Fuck's sake, man. Should have just dackered. Should have just fucking dackered. Fuck's sake. Ugh. So annoying. Um. Yes, yeah, you found out. Lucky, I don't remember how to do a standard eight turn offense. <laughs> I just ended up doing doing all of the passes. <laughs> <laughs> in range of the enemy <laughs> wasn't wasn't ideal <laughs> it's not about the touchback it's about I'm just jamming jamming in all of the saurus and, and the dying tackle and just fucking us isn't it? but it looks like he's not going to jam it all in so it's it's actually not bad at all now i think i preemptively was I was preemptively disappointed there. Looks like he's not jamming in at all. <laughs> Hello, mate, the machine. And <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good, isn't it, in our end? Yep. Ha! <laughs> I mean, I've had some luck, like in this game. Like, I haven't taken any cars and, uh, and have cast out a Saurus on a failed dodge, so, you know. There's been some good luck, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> Fuck off, Al. <laughs> I didn't say that. <laughs> oh, God. Well, this is a terrible perfect defence, isn't it? Very happy about this perfect defence. Woo! And still gave us a gave us a do to punch. So that was nice of him. Je me suis toujours demandé, Bob, si tu fais battre contre Morgan Torg, qui gagnerait? J'ai pas le droit de répondre à ça, Jim. Contrat oblige. Disons que c'est du passé. Motherfucker. Oops. <sighs> well, it's getting a bit nasty now, isn't it? Maybe I should have re-rolled that, but then I wanted, wanted it. Ah, yeah, I should have re-rolled it maybe. Because he can, he can, can make things a bit tricky now, can't he? I didn't want the ball on the on the guard because obviously I want to use the guard to punch things. And if he had got a completion, he'd be on eleven and uh, MVP away from um, leveling. Nearly as perfect record as your man. <laughs> Dirty Dino. Have you seen? Have you seen bloody uh, Kadenix ogres? They're like eight three three or something. <laughs> or they were. I don't know what they are now. Yeah, eight three three. Oh, Jesus Christ. Eight three three with fucking ogres, man. <laughs> what the fuck's that about? <laughs> Alright, so he wasted his blitz, so that's nice. Yes, there is a lot of luck there, obviously, but also a lot of good, a lot of good play, isn't there? That's the thing about Augers, you can't really do it without the good play as well, can you? Even if you get the luck. Yes, I'm, I'm pretty shocked that he didn't try and put some men on round the ball. Especially that diving tackle stand firm guy that he's got. I would have quite liked to have put that near the ball. <laughs> oh, I've got no idea. Not, not very good, Tony. I mean, I haven't played many Olga teams, have I? So you can do... do that so it's probably about you know 14 8 5 or something probably I guess that's, that's quite good actually isn't it to be fair six losses out of 31 that's I'm pretty happy about that actually <laughs> Oh, good job he made it three dice this time. I mean, not for me. <laughs> but good for him. Oh, re needed the non AV break there so he could tie up. Oh, fuck, he's dead. So he could tie up the ogre. Uh, so he could have tied up the crocs and the uh, diamond tackle there. Right, so... Well 
Well done, Reddit. I knew that was coming. Fuck's sake, man. Fuck off. Let me just do a pass. It's not much to ask, is it? Well, that's fucked it, hasn't it? That was looking really quite strong if, if the pass had worked. And he's got the ball and then everything else had moved around. <sighs> Fucking hell, man. Two ones on pickups. And then a one on the pass. Could he have stayed back here? Not really, I don't think. I think it was I think it was worth giving it giving it the catcher. And then like there'd have been more in the way. If this dodge had failed, this guy could have come around. Like there'd have been all sorts of things happening. So yeah, there's your answer, Ducky. No, I don't remember how to do a normal drive. <laughs> <laughs> Completely incapable of a normal drive. Should have just dackered. It's not vanity, Merkel, Mer, Mer, Kel Lincoln. It really wasn't. It really wasn't vanity. Like, he could have kept it back here, but it was risky. I guess his, his strong skink is at the back, so it wasn't too. Maybe I could have just stayed out of range of his strong skink. Maybe. But the plan was to get two guys around him and block him down. And then people here, and then it's pretty safe and the ball's on him. Like it wasn't just it wasn't just heard uh, let's let's try and get a get a vanity pass, because it only puts him in MVP range, like getting the pass on him really wasn't very good. It was just to try and um you know he's part of the screen, isn't he? <laughs> it would be 4 nil by now. Yeah, that's true. But yeah, I guess I should. I guess I should have just dropped back. But then this guy, you know, I don't want this guy to be a pain in my ass, and and or him, you know, if I drop back and he gets a crocs on the ball or the diamond tackle on the ball, then dropping back looks shit. I don't know. It wasn't that easy from well no he can he can yeah okay it's, it is it is easy for him to clear the ball yeah it wasn't that easy though like he had to, you know it wasn't that easy <laughs> like he, it, it took some took some brain power to uh, to do it. it wasn't automatic was it because with him blocking there if he if he hadn't followed, uh, then he couldn't have hit. Like, he had to run around and hit from here. And had to put the assist in as well.
l'équipe forme une cage autour du ballon. Pas bête comme tactique. So annoying. I mean, I guess if he serves him, he's not he's not attacking the ball. But god damn it, can just something work? <laughs> the dice have been pretty horrible this half. First half was nice. Really should have got out one nil ahead. Then then would have dackered. Hello, Skuro. <laughs> ah. Unfortunately, the cross comes in now. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Don't be, don't be mean to the coach, Tom. And I will defend. I will defend. Ha. Huh. <laughs> Thank you very much, Skuro. <laughs> For staying fantastic for 34 glorious months. Oh, yeah. No, Tony. No, 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 no. It's actually not bad at all, is it? Currently. <laughs> Churchill Duck. Looks sick. Woohoo! We still. Glorious. Oh, Femia, it ended, thank God. <laughs> and the, the, the orc's coach name is Drags, and he sure did make it fucking drag on, didn't he? <laughs> but yeah, at least it fucking ended, thank God. Uh, the orcs won, in the end, on turn 24 of overtime. <laughs> Unbelievable, Jeff. One of those two Orylenses, they're, they're a bit, little bit similar, aren't they? He is going to surf this line on. Which is annoying. Maybe I should have probably dodged him out first. But then it's a GFI to hit the ball. Oh no, it's not, no, because I have the guard. Not only pushed the guard there, so it would have been just a GFI to hit the ball. Double GFI to hit the ball. Fuck, that's annoying. Oh god, I wish you'd just do it this fucking year though. Hey, you get fucked. And again, come on. Yes! Outrageous! <laughs> Didn't read the sheet. <laughs> get off my fucking pitch, It was bro. terrible lot of blitz with a strength three, because there was no SPPs to get, so he should have blitz with this guy, shouldn't he? So I wanted him to fail for doing the wrong thing. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I can't really do that. I could hit him though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So he can hit him at the end. Huh. 
He can just stand up, can't he? And then he, he does a job. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, so he can't hit with him. Is he going to block him off and move him? Maybe not. Maybe they just need to leave him there. I know it's a boo for the North Island. I'm sorry. Did level health? <laughs> Amazing! Oh yeah, he was the guy. He was the guy who wanted to get a completion. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, it's not. It's not that the the think you shit or anything, but yeah, it's just. It's just. Um, <laughs> I would say, yeah, people are more critical of those kind of things, aren't they? Like, you know, the scoring early. Whereas really, obviously, with more developed teams especially, it's different, isn't it? But it's kind of typical that, like, people who aren't as good <laughs> are going to learn from Reddit that you've got to blitz the skinks. And then when you see somebody that doesn't blitz the skinks, you're like, oh, this guy's bad. Isn't it? Um, that's, oh, you motherfucker, and I used the app on a shitty lineman. Okay, he's not dead. Whew. Whew. Fuck me, that was pretty horrible having to use the guard as a, as a screen. Could he, I could have moved the guard up and passed it to the guard, but I didn't want to risk another fucking pass the way things had gone. Maybe I should have done though. Maybe I should have done. Yeah, so I think that's the thing with like Chuntran and Aryan, isn't it, specifically? Is that if you like... If the basis of your uh, thing is... <laughs> That's very nice of you, Fairy. But um <laughs> I imagine or do you mean when I'm commentating on the, on the things? That's like you know, I mean obviously we're like kinda of take the piss with the the commentator and the, the chalice games or whatever. But it's uh yeah, the commentators in general, yeah. That's the thing, isn't it? Like, you've got to say something, haven't you? <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, brick. <laughs> I could go for this, and if it's a pow, then he can come round and he can blitz, which is better than the than uh, him dodging. It's not, but it does get him off the sideline. Woo! Now I can three dice this guy. Get the pout. Well, it was horrible. It was very messy and horrible, but managed to destroy skinks. <laughs> so he's got seven players left. Not eight. Eight players versus ten. Which is alright, isn't it? 
Ils doivent conserver la possession du ballon. Une contre-attaque serait terrible. It's rough, isn't it? It's hard to stop. At least this stops him piling down the side, so he's got to at least get collapsed in a bit. I just copied it off Dio, Dr. Satisfying. That's all. <laughs> See you now. <laughs> um, morning to the mic. Yep, that's good. Oh, how with it? Oh, how with it? Like uh, like all three of the commentary team did the other day. That should be the real trio of things. Um, oh, yeah. Yeah, so it's like... But that, that's the thing. That, that's the thing that I think is the most thing with, like... Because obviously Inari and, and Chunter, like, trust in their defensive positioning and everything, don't they? And... And the basing and what have you like what? is done for a reason, but it's easy to look at it and say, "Oh, it's fucking stupid," isn't it? Like it's easy for anyone to say, "Like, oh look, half his team's cars, that was shit and wrong." In the same way as Rick with his with his Kislev, if when he when he doesn't roll as good as normal, it's easy to say, "Oh well, look, that was stupid going for the ball this time," but then if it if it works. Then it looks really right, doesn't it? So, just is what it is. <laughs> well, looks sick. Oh, so he's not going far forward with the skinks. That's good. My kick isn't so good. Gives him a free chance at the pickup. Body painting, hot tub painting. You could do hot tub painting models, couldn't you? That that could be your niche, uh, Skuro. Oh wow, he tried <laughs> tried for the Saurus catch. This could be painful because I think it's probably best just to base up the Saurus. And uh, I think that was a terrible idea. He's only got four turns to score, so and he's down player, so it's pretty easy just to double base the Saurus. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, oh, shit. I think that was a terrible Saurus catch try down 1 0. Like, I don't know what his play was. It was pretty hard to do anything. You know, he's got four turns, but I mean, it definitely involves on carrying on a skink. It's how you win, isn't it? And making some bullshit skink dodges, probably. I probably just have to accept getting my guys banged out. Bang down and out. Like he's got to protect the ball somehow, hasn't he? Which is tricky. It's hard for him to protect the ball and protect his skinks. It would be pretty fucking good, wouldn't it, Skuro? Yeah. That would be pretty amazing. I mean, to be fair, just streaming your dogs all day would be pretty amazing. That would be like that, like the otters, you know. That was that would be pretty good. Yeah, the otter stream is pretty hard to beat. Yeah, exactly. So just just streaming, just streaming your dogs all day would be pretty fucking pretty baller, to be honest. I'd buy that for a dollar. That would still be good though, Scooter. <laughs> People would watch. I, I reckon you'd get a lot of viewers on motionless 
motionless dogs in the dirt. Alright, so we can put a guard in here, 2D him, and then dodge through for a tackle hit. How bad is it if this fails? I'm going to go with needlessly. Needlessly bad. I don't know if you can reach. After all that, there you can. Fuck for that. Woo! Hey, remove the skink. Right, so now the ball's based with tackle. Every Saurus is based. And unfree upable. So, fingers crossed. One more injured skin. I'll try, I'll try and do it. I'll try and do it. <laughs> yeah, Famia, to be fair. <laughs> that would certainly... <laughs> that would certainly appeal to uh, at least some of Twitch, the Twitch viewer base. Wouldn't it? I mean, they watch. People watch Amaranth sleep, don't they? So, if they watch Amaranth sleep, they watch your dog sleep. That's uh, that's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there you go. And he's gonna blitz him and base the tackler. I wish I had beavers. I wish I had like that otter stream but with beavers it'd be amazing, wouldn't it? Holy shit. Oh he didn't base he didn't base the tackler! <laughs> My god! As old Artemis would say, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he's hoping I'll forget Diamond Tackle again. But I'm, I'm not going to forget Diamond Tackle again. Um, do you want me? I can't make it three. I can make it three dice. But like it, it stops the recovery a bit.
blockless block. Should have stood him up first, shouldn't I? Phew. Third dice doing the biz. Don't get the cars. So he's got to go and tank him. Further, I should have GFI'd with him first. Oh, oh there is a beaver one! Amazing! <laughs> Glorious! <laughs> there is a... There is a beaver side. Oh, there you go. Thanks, Tony. Amazing. I like not picking sidestep for the bludger catcher. Yeah, it's it's paid off, hasn't it? It's paid off. Uh, it's paid off this game certainly. Oh, damn it! He, he he did the right thing. I wasn't sure of his ability to <laughs> to free <laughs> to free Saurus, and like I'd kept you know I'd kept them. Based correctly other times. It would have needed a 2 plus without a reroll. Like, I would have gone for it if I'd still had the reroll. Maybe I should have done it anyway. But I thought, hopefully, you just won't see it. And he might not roll a pow anyway, right? There's a chance he just doesn't roll a pow. Hey! There it is. <laughs> wee, wee, wee. Been very lucky this game, to be fair. Um. Not easy to get the uh, hit here, is it? I'm just going to punch him and try and bomb him. Boo. Gets in the way, but it doesn't matter if he goes there, because it's still still in range to do the pass. <laughs> Glorious. Well, that was really that was pretty much a dicing that game, wasn't it? I don't feel <laughs> don't feel like I played well at all that game, but um, got removals. And he had shocking block Absolutely shocking. Gonna put Dimmy in the middle so that he's more likely to get banged out. Because people tend to put their crocs in the middle. But I guess he might not move it now. So maybe I should have put Dimmy on the crocs. 
but at least the the skill guys on the other end. Oh. GG easy. I bet he did, yeah, Aurelensis. I bet he did. I bet he did. The uh, carried the team, the midfield engine. Dimmy fucking G. Glorious. Oh, you meant like Dimmy in the middle, as in thingy in the middle. I thought you were talking about his near pro football career. Sorry. I was confused. Yes, yeah, so I should have just left him on the uh, Crocs. Because he probably wasn't going to move him. Yeah, okay. Never mind. Please don't. Please don't, Aurelensis. Please don't. <laughs> Please don't. Dubu survives. Please no snipes. Please no. Not chops. Why would you do such a thing? You horrible bastard. Chops. God, imagine having to play against Chos. It's the worst, isn't it? No, oh, well, that was a nice win. I just really look. I mean, it was really lucky, wasn't it? That could have so easily gone back in. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so glad that game didn't happen to me. Woo! <laughs> hey. Oh, but if he'd got his completion, he would have leveled. Disgusterous. Um, I really want to see what the uh, block dice were here because it was stupid. 37. It wasn't actually that many. Like, it was obviously too many, but 37, 29, 30. It wasn't as crazy as I've seen, but it was, it was pretty bad, wasn't it? It was pretty bad in total. And obviously just how many 1 in 9s he rolled. Like, you got loads of pals here, to be fair. But then, er, 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 er. <laughs> oh, this is what's fucked him. Getting them at the same time, isn't it? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So he's rolled nine, ten one in nines off 43 blocks. So he's rolled twice as many one in nines as he should. So while the distribution isn't that crazy, it was the fact that they all came together is... Uh, is what absolutely wrecked him. 18, 25, 23. So quite nice dice. Dodges were shit. TFIs were on point. Catches were pretty bad, but didn't matter so much, I guess, because of catch. The pickups were only slightly bad. So there you go. Woo! Glorious. Don't you dare, Al. Two levels though, very good. I'll click on the wrong one, brilliant. Ooh, a double, a double, a double. A double, I think that's going to be another guard. Uh, but, <laughs> going at first is going to make, God, there's so many project players now, because, you know, Aurelensis needs blodge. And Jobu will need dodge and and then block. So like, God, it's gonna just take so long, so long to bloody get him up, get him up to power. But I can't skip. I can't. I can't take dodge first. I just can't, can I? Like it's so cool having so much guard. Having so much guard is like ridiculous, isn't it? Having two blodge guard catches. Is is going to be insane, to be fair, and then obviously some some will die as well, so it's not terrible. And he will go dodge or wrestle or something. I'll think a little bit about him before taking it. Um, but there you go, nine one zero. What a glorious record! Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.